Denali is special to me because um, it's my backyard. I spend tons of time in it and people come from all around the world to come visit Denali, to visit the wilderness, to visit all the animals, just to, just to see it. And I get that everyday experience of being here. It just shows how beautiful Alaska is and it, um, it always reminds me that I'm just a part of something bigger. It's like whenever I hike a mountain and go up top, I'm just, I'm a part of the world and it reminds me to take care of it and just keep it as beautiful as it is. I like how during the winter not very many people come because then it's more special to me to come out. Like just come to like the park entrance during the winter is just, it's so different even from Healy. There's just no, no snow machine tracks, no four wheeler tracks. It's just, so you can just see the snow and how it's supposed to look. Well, I originally thought that having trails was just for mainly protection of the land here, but I, over the last couple days I learned that it's also a way for people to get out and, you know, get out of their car and just walk without, you know, people feel safer on the trail, you know. Yesterday we went to the old sites. We got to look at some places where they hunted mammoths and other animals. It was 13,000 years old, and we got to look at some of the tools that, well, the shards of the tools that they had made. We found a few artifacts around the ground. We got to look for them and flag them and talk about them. So that was a really good experience. I think one of the coolest things I've seen is during these intensives uh, was when uh, we're looking at the LiDAR maps, we're making our way up the hill, and we found where the fault lines were, and you could just really clearly see these deep trenches that were like twice as, uh, as tall as me uh, into the earth, and it was just a lot of fun to kind of see that and understand. I mean, I, I've lived here my whole life, never realized that they were like right there. Honestly, I really liked the first day when we were all in the um, science building and we all got together and like talked and just like learned more about Denali because you know like I didn't know certain things even though it's like right in my back door, you know. It's like one of my awesome experiences I've never had even though it's pretty dirty and most girls in Healy don't want to get dirty. Well, I, I just want to see this program continued because I've had a great time with it for, throughout my entire high school career. I mean, we're almost done with the sea camp cabins. I just I want to see this continued, maybe build something else for the park somewhere down here. Maintaining interest, I think. Um, people need to remember that it's here and that they need to take care of it if they want it to remain as special as it is for future generations. Giving back to the park is really, I think, a way that I can help you know, keep everybody safe, you know, keep it the way it is now. Um, just because I love it, you know, I mean, it's, it's such a big part of my life, so I just want to make sure that it stays the way it is.